All right, this has to be quick because the battery is at 13%. So, life update. I'm hopefully joining a band on Wednesday. So I'm having a tryout with them. I think it'll work out just fine. The uh, vocalist to uh, 15 stitches is uh, leaving the band because he has just too many things that he has to do with his life, with kids, his wife, number of things, and they need a new vocalist. And I've worked with them before. Previously, I I wasn't that interested in work in in, in working with them because nothing to do with your musicianship because your musicianship is great. It's the fact that they weren't going to really go a kind of a jazz fusion direction, which is where I wanted to go, but you just don't find that here in Tacoma. And uh, I probably would have been their lead singer if I would have just went with them before. But now, you know, we have an understanding that uh, uh, they're a rock band, it's, they're, they're not going to just suddenly change that. And so I'm going to be working with them, hopefully. Um, prior to 2010, which was around when I really started focusing on YouTube, and making YouTube videos and rants and vents and all that sort of thing, I was quite a proficient music writer. It was very common of me to write a few songs a week. And then I focused on YouTube. Now I used to be able to not, I, I couldn't talk to a camera. I couldn't talk to an audience. I didn't know how to handle having an audience. Just didn't know how to do it. Yet it was a skill I wanted to get. This has been something that has been one of the major reasons for me doing YouTube in the first place. It was so I could get good at talking to a camera, good at talking to an audience, because that sort of thing is, that sort of skill is pretty necessary when you're in a band. But when I, when I did, when I started focusing on that, my music writing went Pfft. I just wasn't writing anymore. Then I went on Zyprexa for a couple years and that really messed some things up. Then when I got off of that, I still wasn't writing. But I was focusing so much on YouTube. Now I'm finding my music writing again. I'm finding my musicality back again. And it's making me happy. I'm very pleased with getting back into music writing. As far as I'm concerned, anyone, if they put the effort into it, can make ranting videos on YouTube. Anyone can be honest. Anyone if they put their mind to it and they... Anyone can have the courage to do this if they work hard at it. Anyone can do it. But, to toot my own horn, not everyone is talented musically. I have some talents. I don't want to waste them. And if I'm spending most of my effort on making ranting videos on YouTube, what am I doing with my actual talents? Nothing. That's what I'm doing with, with my talents. Okay? There are so many reasons why me not doing these the, the ranting videos is a good thing. And maybe you all don't see it. There are many reasons. The last video was one of the most major reasons. But there are many reasons. Let's see if I was covering up the mic. Almost covering up the mic. Um, and now the battery is at 7%. But, uh... There are many reasons why, I'm, why I am making this decision. Now, maybe you don't think... Uh, pursuing music is a worthy thing. Well, that's you. For me, it's a worthy thing. I've lived most of my life for music. And I've 
kind of put that on hold since 2010. It'll be nice to be back in a band again. And, you know, if I, if I don't get in this band, I will start really, really pushing forth to be in other bands. I know I'll find a group. But this is what my, I want my focus to be on. This is why I talk about, you know, music being this thing. It's not like I'm going to be dropping off the face of YouTube. You'll see quite a bit of me. It's just not going to be the same focus. So, just letting you know. This is a life update video. I'm making major changes.